Hey guys, Brett here, and in this video, I'm taking a look at a new cloud based video software called Easy Spokesperson Creator. Now, what Easy Spokesperson Creator does is it allows you to create spokesperson videos. So, we've all seen these kinds of videos. It's a person standing up, usually on a backdrop, that's talking about a particular product or a particular service. And you can use these videos on your sales pages, you can use them on your squeeze pages. And one of my favorite things to use these types of videos for is on Facebook ads for driving traffic. Now I'm going to show you exactly how Easy Spokesperson Creator works. So as soon as you log in the software, you're going to see something that looks very similar to this. And the first thing you need to do is select the template that you want to use. Now there are four different categories of templates. There are affiliate marketing, internet marketing, local business, and promos. And if you click on any of these categories, it will then show you all of the templates that are available for these particular categories. Now, when I'm testing here, I notice that there are a lot of templates. There are tons of them. And I'm going to have to actually contact the product vendors to see if all of these templates come with the front end or if some of them are part of the OTO. This particular category right here, uh, from what you can see here, there's a lot of templates and there's actually three pages of templates. So there's many, many templates here. And I kind of think that this might be part of the OTO upgrade. If it is, though, that is probably something worth considering because more templates is just going to be better. And also that's a reasonable upgrade because more templates took more money and more time to create. So it is reasonable that they would be an upgrade. So let me go ahead and find a template that I want to use. I'm going to go into the Internet Marketing section because I'm in the Internet Marketing niche. And I will find a template that I like. Okay, so here's one uh, called Getting Internet Traffic. It's by Todd Gross. I'm going to go ahead and click on this one right here. And I can now go ahead and edit my template. So the first thing that I'm probably going to want to edit is going to be this overlay. Now I can change the overlay image if I want. I can go ahead and click on Change Image. And it will allow me to pick a different overlay image. I can select one from the library. Or I can go ahead and upload my own if I want. I'm going to go ahead and pick a red one because that matches the color scheme of my website. You go ahead and pick lower thirds red. I'll click on choose. Click on save. And to edit this text, I can go ahead and click on the text and it will then allow me to edit it. So I'm going to click and I'm going to change this to sign up today. And I'll go ahead and save that. And this whole thing that says getting internet traffic, I can edit that too if I want, but I'm perfectly fine with that being the way it is. So I'm going to go ahead and continue now. Click the button to continue the next step. And you can see there are then some additional options. So I can add in an intro video or an outro video. So if I have a logo stinger or something like that, I can add that in here. I'm not going to do that though. I can go ahead and add an audio track. So I'm going to go ahead and click on choose from library. And I'm going to add in an audio track. And in order to test the tracks, all I need to do is click on this play button and I can preview the audio tracks that I'm checking out. I'll go ahead and pause this and test a couple to see one that I like. Okay, and I kind of like this corporate dance one. So I have that one highlighted. I have it selected. I'll go ahead and click on the choose button. And the last thing I want to change is to add a background image. So you can see originally on the template video, it just had a black background. And I don't want to have a black background. I want to have something that looks a little more professional and that looks a little more high quality. I can go ahead and upload my own background if I want to, but I'm just going to choose one from the library. So I'm going to go ahead and click on choose from library. Let me find a background that I'm interested in using. There are quite a few of them here. I probably wouldn't pick the bathroom background for an, a video on traffic. Uh, so let's go ahead and find something that's a little more relevant. And you know what? I kind of like this, uh, this red curtain. So I'm actually just going to go ahead and select this red curtain. I'll click on choose. And then that's it. All I need to do now is go over here and click on continue. And I can go ahead and click the render it button underneath there. I'll enter in a title for my template so it could save it for later editing and I'll just call it Brett's Last Test. Save that. Now I have to click on render it. Sorry, I should have saved it first. Render it. 
it says in here that it's important it may take some time to render I actually tested this several times this is not the first test that I've done and in the test that I've done it takes about a minute and 10 seconds to render now this may be longer when the software goes live and more people are using it but even if it doubles it's only going to be about 10 minutes so let me go ahead and click on OK and we'll go ahead and let this render here okay so my video is done being rendered I can go ahead and click on the download button and let's just open this up and have a look at it. The internet has brought about incredible changes. The internet has brought about like incredible changes and, and opportunities like. And there you have it. You can see my video. We just watched it together. It's got my background. It's got my Todd Gross spokesperson because that's the one I selected. And it's got my call to action. And as I said, you can use these types of videos for your squeeze pages. You can use them for your sales pages. You can use them for Facebook ads. Uh, there's a lot of uses for videos like this. I think it's going to be great for anybody that doesn't have the technical ability to edit videos or to create their own kinds of videos. It's very easy to do and they are professional quality videos that you get. Now I wanted to see how using a software like this will compare to just hiring somebody in Fiverr as far as finances go. I wanted to see if it's going to be cheaper to just hire somebody on Fiverr or if it's going to be cheaper to use the software. Uh, so I went over to Fiverr and I did a search for spokesperson. I have found a whole bunch of gigs that are available and it looks initially like they're cheaper. You can actually see this gig is $5. Now it has an eight day delivery time. So that means it takes eight days just to get your video. So if you don't mind waiting, you might be able to pay $5. And that looks like it's going to be the cheaper option. However, you have to keep in mind, this is just for a plain white background. If you go down to the gig extras, you can see things actually cost a lot more than just $5. If you want to add background music, it's an extra 10 bucks. You want to add an uh, overlay, it's an extra 10 bucks. You want to add a logo, that's an extra 10 bucks. So getting a video like the ones you can make with Easy Spokesperson Creator is actually going to cost around $25 to $35 and it's going to take you a week to actually get your video. So not only is Easy Spokesperson Creator much faster and much more flexible and much more customizable, but it's also a lot more cost effective. Uh, the price of just getting one of these videos made on Fiverr would cover the price of the entire Easy Spokesperson Creator package. Because of the fact that it's more cost effective, because of the fact that it's super easy to use, and because of the fact that the videos are surprisingly customizable, even though the scripts are very generally written, I think that this is well worth investing in for anybody that wants to do squeeze pages, anybody that wants to use it on their sales pages, and more importantly, anybody that wants to run Facebook ads. Alrighty guys, thank you and enjoy.